Tinko's got the green pumps, green pumps, green pumps. Tinko's got the green pumps now. Can you dig it? Tinko's got the green pumps, green pumps, green pumps. Tinko's got the green pumps now. Beep, beep, fat, fat, po, po, bum. Look at Tinko now and what they've done. Bringing you e-smart, whose comfort is green. Low flow injection pump before chilling them beep. System solution for hydraulics design. Drag and drop, ease lets you go and bring it on time. Tinko's got the green pumps, green pumps, green pumps. Tinko's got the green pumps now. And now it is my pleasure to introduce to you the president and CEO of Taco Incorporated, Mr. John White, Jr. Now listen, let me just take, we've got a lot to, um, to share with you folks today, but, uh, but first, you know, uh, let me just uh, share a few thoughts uh, of my own. The first of which is uh, what I always tell you folks, and, and it's how much uh, you all mean to me and to Taco. Um, as I think back about the years we've spent building this business, um, the integral role that that you and the in the press have have played in in our success uh, is no small thing. Uh, and so I thank you for that. And you know, one of the one of the great things about having uh, grown and developed this business for uh, you know, the 30 years that, that I've been here has been the chance to see it in so many different phases, uh, see it in so many different times, good times and difficult times, uh, fun times and not so fun times, uh, but never having strayed from the values and the ideas that we've had and the uh, beliefs that we've had. And there's a few constants through all of that. And you know, because there's been many times when, uh, certainly there are many times when people uh, want to buy this business from me. And uh, there are times when I've thought about that. Uh, but I've always come back to the belief that uh, we've done pretty well together. And um, I think that the support that we've gotten from you uh, has been a big part of that confidence building for me. To the point that now uh, we are in the beginning of feathering in our fourth generation of the White family, who's begun working at Taco uh, this year, and it's a great moment for me and for all of us, I think. Uh, we have so many, so I thank you for, for all of your support and friendship. Um, we have so much going on. This year is uh, like almost every other and probably a little more so, uh, uh, both from a product standpoint and from a company standpoint, and these folks are going to give you a little bit more specific idea of what, what I'm talking about. but. Um, on the product side, we have tremendous uh, advancements in the, in the pump side of the business, both in, in our uh, product range and offering and our efficiencies that uh, are being improved all the time. We have some tremendous new high efficient uh, circulator pumps coming to the market and, uh, and larger pumps also. Uh, the Fall River business has continued to grow. The, the welded products business has continued to grow and prosper tremendously, unlike any business of that type that I've ever seen anywhere. Uh, uh, Bob Lee has been uh, continuing to bring new products to the market uh, to allow us to grow and, and expand that part of the business. Um, the residential side of the business is, is screaming ahead and doing very well, and, and, and I think Mark Chaffee will talk a little bit about that. Uh, so, uh, and the iWorks, oh my gosh, the iWorks has taken us a year to land on our feet with, uh, and we talked about it last year. This year, you're going to really see where that's, where that's headed. I think it's, it's uh, very exciting. Um, one of the biggest projects this year, uh, and for some of the local folks, you may have caught some of this in the newspapers, uh, Taco has decided uh, to embark on a tremendous expansion of our facility. 
about four or five years ago, we uh, expanded the, uh, the facility and, and built a, a, a super duper warehouse, which has been uh, tremendously efficient and, and productive for our, uh, for our operations. But now, uh, as I look back over the last 10 years, you know, we've invested uh, in the last 10 years around $80 million in uh, the operation side of the business. You know, the plant and equipment, efficiency, uh, automation, uh, uh, quality, all of those things. And very little in the front end of the business. Uh, the learning center and the, uh, the office areas, the training areas. Uh, uh, and so it's time to do that. We have a world-class company, and we need to, uh, uh, to continue to, uh, to provide uh, uh, that throughout the whole business. So uh, also I'm finding, and this is particularly interesting, uh, I'm finding that five years ago I thought uh, we'd see very little customer uh, presence at, at the factory. You know, I thought technology would take us to a, uh, a whole different place where, where uh, we'd be on the road with our training and activities of that type. In fact, it's quite the opposite. And more great relationships and, uh, are happening as a result of customer uh, visits to Taco. Uh, so uh, I think Chris is going to uh, go over the, the building plans. It's, it's quite significant and very exciting and, and uh, by golly, something that uh, uh, we're extremely proud of. So having said all that, I'm going to turn this over to Chris. I just want one more time to uh, to thank you all for your support, your presence, your friendship. It means a great deal to me personally. So have a wonderful show, and it's great to see everybody. God bless.